Another important fundamental that is important to understand is temperature. How high your temperatures get in the summer and how low your temperatures get in the winter. This will determine what you are able to grow in your climate because all plants have a temperature tolerance threshold. It will also determine when you plant things. For example, if you have really high temperatures in the summer, you'll probably, you will use that to know that you need to plant earlier during your mild winters, for example. So some plants will die stone dead as soon as the temps drop below freezing. Um, here's an example of this. Dahlias, for example, as soon as it hits freezing, they just die stone dead. A day before this picture was taken, they were just beautiful and doing great, and then boom, they look like that. Um, some plants can handle temperatures below freezing, but let's say at about 10 degrees Fahrenheit, they will finally die. A lot of chrysanthemum varieties will fall into that category. Sometimes a plant can handle a certain temperature for a little bit of time, but if it drops below a certain temperature for a sustained amount of time, it will die. So especially below freezing point, that will be the case for a lot of plants. On the flip side, the heat can burn up certain varieties. Pansies, for example, will grow in my garden really well until about late June. And when the, te and when the temperatures are consistently above 90 degrees Fahrenheit and the dry air settles in, my pansies dry up and die. Some basic rules are that most annuals tend to die at temperatures below freezing point, and a lot of flowers start to get stressed when temperatures are consistently around 100 degrees Fahrenheit. This is a very loose rule, but you can use it as a starting point when you are trying to understand what can grow in your climate and when to plant. For now, just do a quick search of how high and how low your temperatures go and write those numbers down. Use that as a guide when you are picking plants. If you live in a place that has extremely hot summers, like I mentioned, temperatures consistently above 100 degrees Fahrenheit, then you might choose plants that are marked as heat tolerant. But if, if it's really hot, then you'll probably shift your growing season to be during milder temperatures and treat your summer like other growers would treat their winter. If your temperatures get extremely cold, then you might not be able to overwinter crops like other zones can. Overwintering means planting perennials and biennials in late summer, early fall, then letting those plants establish and then go dormant in the winter and then they'll wake up with the spring. So if you get really low temperatures, you might not be able to do that with certain plants. Basically, it just comes down to having a good understanding of how hot or cold your climate gets that understanding will help you know what you can plant and when you can plant.